Okay guys, welcome back to another video. Today what I'm going to do, I'm going to review this uh, brand new Bulls Callaway Warbird. Um, I just got this as a gift from my cousin, so if you're watching this, thank you for the Bulls. They're sweet. I haven't used them yet, so I'm going to do this review and I'm going to review it against the uh, Pro V1 X. A brand new ball, Pro V1 X. Um, now the comparison will consist in putting and some chipping around the green. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, putt them. There's no flex in this green right now, so I'm just going to putt to the ball. I'm going to hit both the uh, Pro V1X, brand new, and the uh, Callaway Warbird. And just going to go around first and short, some short uh, distance putts and see how it feels. Okay, so I hit a few balls and I have to tell you right away that uh, on those short pots, uh, the Pro V1X does feel much better. The feel is definitely better. Um, I don't know whether it's, uh, if I could say like it's a huge difference, but definitely I like the way it feels and it sounds off the face of the putter compared to the uh, Callaway. The Callaway seems a little bit more, uh, a little hard. Now I'm going to do uh, some longer uh, distance spots. Okay, so this one is a little less noticeable and I kind of like feel like the other review that I made with the Inesis ball is like if you hit it off the sweet spot uh, it, it feels a little better, kind of like the Pro V1. Whereas the Pro V1 it already feels good, and if you hit it off the sweet spot, it feels even better. So I don't know if that makes any sense, but um, it's really noticeable on the shorter pots. On the longer pots, a little less. Okay, so now I'm gonna chip to all of these three uh, flags, starting with the blue one, and I'm gonna hit both balls and see how it feels around the, the green here. I'm just in a 52 for this. Okay, so I chipped around two different flags. Uh, here again, I think it's the same as the putting. Uh, depends whether you hit it off the sweet spot or not. Um, it is a little noticeable, uh, but I don't really feel it as much as the shorter putts. Uh, definitely on the shorter putts, you definitely feel it, no question about it. Okay, so I'm gonna go back a little more. I'm gonna aim at the uh, blue flag, which is the farthest flag. Uh, this is like from the rough, so I'm gonna see if there's any any difference. Uh, it's about... Uh, I think 25, 30 yards. Okay, so from the rough, there's no difference uh, at all, in my opinion. Uh, now let me hit it from here uh, to the blue flag from this, uh, this grass right here and see if I notice any difference. Okay, that felt good. That felt good. Let me take a few more shots. Okay, so from tighter grass, cut shorter, yeah, you can feel a little more. You definitely feel that uh, when you hit the Pro V1, it just feels much softer and it has a nice feel to it uh, compared to the Callaway. It's not about the Callaway. But when you hit them both, you can notice a difference, definitely. Uh, on the rough, no, no difference at all. And uh, on the putting, more on the short putts. So I think, uh, you know, this Callaway uh, is considered a premium ball. And for me, 
there is not much difference between this colorway and the, the Indesis ball that I play, which is about like half its price. So I would say you either gonna get you either play with the best, which is the probably one or something similar to it, or you can play with just uh, some cheap balls that are not I mean not the cheap cheap balls, but the those that are that are proven to be uh, they have a good feel to it. So like the Indesis ball, I'm definitely happy with that one. And uh, if I were to compare the colorway with the Indesis, I don't I don't think. I would see much uh, of a difference there. You know, they both uh, feel about the same. Actually, I would even think that uh, the Indus is probably already did a review on it. So make sure to check that out. I, I did a review on it against the probably one at the course. So they were very close, and I think they were also very similar in the comparison. So, anyways, uh, hope you liked the review. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and until next time.